Hey everyone, welcome back to Sekiro. Told you this series wasn't going away. Um, despite uh, what you may have seen, you may have seen my big update video on how I'm like uh, reworking my YouTube strategy. And I think that's not too grandiose a term going forward. Um, YouTube strategy. I did mention that this game isn't going anywhere or this playthrough. Um, and I'm holding true to that because I'm really enjoying playing this game. Uh, I just haven't gotten around to recording. Uh, you know, I did that video and I was kind of like busy and all that. We had a three day weekend and this is actually day three. Fuck, face cam. I'm not even listening to this guys. I'm gonna... God, there's a lot of dialogue in this game. I just want to get my shit. Uh, my loaded shur shuriken. Fuck yeah. I like the shuriken. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna continue this game because... Well, this game is sick. We just need to get back to where we died. Because we got our asses handed to us. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. I could go back to the past, but we're not gonna do that just yet. Um, I feel like you need to be sort of more advanced... Uh, at least have the first boss done and have some HP or like stronger or whatever um, before going there. All right, let's talk to Emma as well. She has a lot of dialogue. This is a nice angle. Damn, the sun is shining there. It's finally shining here. Ah, oh, kind of. It's kind of cloudy. Of course, what would this game be without a waifu? Um, Emma is this game's waifu. And that's pretty much how we go. Uh, let's speed this up a bit. We know the gourd. She can upgrade it. Which is good. Because you get more heals. She's also going to babble on about this for quite a bit. Had to hold his bong water. I've made that bong water joke so many times at this point. Yeah, yeah, Gord. Seeds, we know. Listen, this is not lore critical, um, so I'm just gonna like blaze through this. Blaze through this? What the fuck am I saying? That didn't make no sense. Okay, I think I only have one. Dogen, who we can actually meet in this game. Oh, by the way, I'm gonna also try going for some of the quest lines that I missed in playthrough one, the YouTube playthrough one. Okay, cool. I'll talk to, you know what, I'll talk to her off screen. She has so much dialogue. I'll summarize it in, uh, like, um, I don't know. We'll do a five second recap. So, five second summary. Uh, we can resurrect, which is a little bit strange. Uh, she doesn't think it comes free. And then she looked at our face. We got a little bit pervy, which is, I think, all good on Mr. Sekiro's um, kind of part. I'm going to go back to where I died, uh, so I'll see you guys there. Okay, I think it's worth showing from here because not many there's there it is the gaijin sugar the truly the most famous sekiro item i thought you could reach that fuck what if you can't reach that i'm screwed then okay now nah, i can't be i can't be screwed no we're good i was gonna say there's a secret path here or you can make it back to 
almost where he died, uh, allowing us to continue here, hopefully this time without being blasted in the face. And I think also if we go to the top, uh, there should be a merchant there. So yeah, welcome back to Sekiro once again. I'm saying this like this is a stream, but this is not <laughs> on the tent guy. These dudes are fucking crazy. There he is with that cannon. Blasted us. So this guy actually has mad useful shit. In fact, that's the thing we want. Robert's firecrackers. Uh, I don't know what I can sell. Nothing really. I'm not too. I'm not doing too hot. On the good old money front here, uh, which is a little bit of a shame. Because man, those Robert firecrackers are good. I think it's because I've been forgetting to vacuum up uh, the money, which is actually something really crucial that I should be doing. So I'm a little bit of an idiot. So we're gonna stab this guy. I'm also gonna turn my... No, we're... the TV is okay. I thought this would be too loud, but it's not. Yeah, that's what I've been failing to do. I didn't know there were so many of you here. Don't even worry about it. All of you are gonna get fucked up anyways. Told you. God, the combat is so satisfying in this game. I can't say it enough times. Um, I, I don't know, it's just satisfying is the only word I can use for it. I think there's like some secret down here, right? Two Mibu balloons. I've never once fucking used these things. And the snake, snake skin. Snake skin. Can't even talk. And a little shortcut. I'm gonna have to drink there because I accidentally pressed square. So I just like dropped to my death. Suicide forest, you know. Gonna get a Logan Paul here to film it. Where does this take us? I like, genuinely don't remember. Um. Oh, there it is. Yeah, yeah. The statue. Cool. I remember now. This is a nice shortcut. Because there is some like mad ass enemies coming up here. And a sort of semi boss. Mini boss is the proper word. Semi boss. It's only a semi boss. And that's where we just were. And I know what I forgot to do. Uh, I forgot to talk to the lady too. And her son. Which is actually sort of a key quest line. Uh, I'll, I'll try killing this ogre and then we'll go back and do that. Just so you know that there is some action in this episode as well. There's also a full up here, I think, if I'm not mistaken. Right? There isn't? Maybe? Why did I think there was? Huh. Well, okay, maybe I don't remember as much about this game as I thought. Give me them pellets. I'm gonna be needing them. I swear there should be one more enemy here somewhere. 
Like, I remember him. Member berries. Hmm. Strange. Maybe they deleted him from the game. Oh, he's up there. This dude. We gotta kill quickly, because... Even though they're not on the same side, him and the ogre... Do not kill each other. Oh, get off the fucking ledge. We come back here, ogre. Told you, that hurt. Drink. So yeah, this dude is mm, fucking difficult. Uh, his grab is really quick. Sometimes it's like really... Oh yeah, and he's fucking doing wrestling moves. Uh, it can come out of nowhere. It's way easier if you have the firecracker item. Because he's actually like scared of it. But that is a... That's the attack. And w I wish I had... God damn it! Body slam! I got fucking SPD'd again. Uh, resurrect, bitch. Cool, and that's only phase one. He's only gonna get crazier from here. I'm staying the hell away from him. Told you. Pro wrestler. Guy, that could stun him a little bit longer, couldn't it? Fuck. I don't think I've ever managed to kill this guy. First attempt. But here's hoping, you know. That's the one. It's a fucking insta kill. No, no, and I'm dead. I hate this enemy. <gasps> I didn't know you get another one. Don't even think about it. Kill him. Eat shit, chained ogre. Naisu, Naisu, Naisu. That is... That is not an easy enemy. Uh, believe me. Uh, I'm speaking from experience. I mean, obviously it doesn't hold a candle to, like, actual bosses, but... Considering the boy's not played Sekiro in a long time, I feel like... Um, that was a decent attempt. Cool. This is the closest... Bonfire to them, right? I'm not sure. Wait, can I attack from the air? Hold on. Yeah, I can. Huh. Well, whatever. Cool. Here we are. This is going to be a lot of dialogue. Time for the patented Mr. Sketchhead five second preview or summary. Not preview. What am I talking about? That is part of the key summary. She is very important because she gives you access to the dream world. I completely forgot that. And now for the sun. So, what is the five second summary? Well, she unfortunately is suffering from like dementia or something. Pretty much dementia. And she wants to see her son. The tragedy is, Vati prepared to cry 
uh, is that her son is literally five feet away from her. What am I doing? Uh, I, I want I want to fight. Uh, and he is in bad shape, so we are like the mediators between them. And there's some like deeper lore to it too, but again, there's like a whole ass prepared to cry on this, so you know. I would direct you to that. I mean, we're all Vati fans, fans, Vati fans here. So one more thing we need to do here. And that thing to do is to kill that guy. Who you can actually sneak attack. I don't think... I might be able to get him. Hell yeah. God, these things are creepy. Really cool though. Not sure if these count as yokai or not, but whatever. Okay, it's time to move on. Uh, and I actually did something I've never done. I used a fucking Mibu Balloon of Wealth. I wanted to try it. And it does give you more cash, which is... Pretty cool, actually. Gourd Seed. And there should be a checkpoint here once we hit that up. I'm gonna go back because I have some skill points. Oh, no, you don't actually even need to go back, do you? I completely forgot how this goddamn game works. The only reason I'm like farming for cash is because uh, truly that Robert's firecracker item is um, incredibly, incredibly useful. So I want to get that ASAP. And there is a way to get through this area stealthily. I think the way to do that is to not overthink stuff. Because there's like a little spotter there, but... Yeah, you just need to turn around. Hopefully you do turn around. The other hope is that you're blind as shit. No, you're not. No, you're not. Well, that's a complication. How do I Metal Gear Solid this? You just need to be pretty quick. Yeah, and there's nothing going on here. Uh, no murders. For sure. Fuck. That's the spotter. Don't worry. I'm a Sekiro combat master. Can't even hit me with bullets. I'm like, I don't know. Neo. And not the game. I'm talking about the movie. So yeah, that stealth was... Um, not my proudest. Isn't exactly how I intended it to go. But hey. We're not fucking... I don't know. We're not going for a perfect stealth run here. I don't even know if there's such a thing. But well, we do have to fight the general now. Who is not easy. He hits like a truck. As we've just discovered.
Oh shit, that fucking... What a cheater. Yeah, we're both gonna go for that, why not? That's only one. That's only one. Yeah, I'm gonna like try to attract him down here. Because this is the arena where like you're meant to fight him. I'm so fucking out of healing items. Ouch. I'm gonna fell it. Ouch. How did that... Okay, that did kill me. Now, normally what's meant to happen here, I'm gonna be honest with you, is that you're meant to get a drop attack on him. And take one of his HP bars. I've not managed to do that. As you can very much tell. And I very much died. Well, I get to try the stealth section, at least. Again. And I think this is where I screwed up, because you're meant to come from this away. Something still fucking noticed me. Which is unbelievable. But, all I have to do is lose them. In fact, that might not be such a bad idea. Yes, because there is a Sculptor's, sculptor's Idol here. Which is actually way better for taking on this entire section. Uh, this is much more like it. Bam. Get your fucking pots and pans out of here. Yeah, these guys are having much worse of a day. Of course, what that allows you to do is do this and still screw up because you should have attacked him. Whatever. I got this. Maybe I don't got this, but I got this. Oh, he just straight up armors through some attacks. remember this motherfucker being this difficult, honestly. Give me the cash. Fuck.
damn. Damn, damn, damn. Do I have another... I have another Resurrect. Okay. Come on, pull together. Oh, I hate his armor. Do I have him? I have him, don't I? Easiest thing I've ever done. That dude was a bitch too. Didn't even... Didn't even break a sweat. That's how easy that guy was. Good thing too, I mean you always want to end on an easy enemy. Um, yeah, no sweat. Thanks Sekiro, you are... Truly the easiest Souls game. I'm gonna go ahead. I think that was enough excitement for today. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up uh, today's episode of Sekiro. Episode 2 actually. This is gonna be more frequent. It's just that, you know, with the... Again, not hopefully not too grandiose YouTube strategy change. Uh, there's also gonna be some other videos which you will hopefully enjoy. Um, as I've talked about in that update. For now guys, I still wanna thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this episode of Sekiro. It was a fun one. And I'll see all of you next time. Take care, peace out, and goodbye.